The pendulum is a wonderful tool, simple, transformational, and extremely effective. So first of all, let's, let's draw a pendulum. So this is just like the pendulum you see in a, a grandfather clock or any kind of clock you can imagine. And the pendulum hangs from the point at the top and swings from one side to the other. So here we're going to say this represents the highs and this represents the lows. The high and the low of life. So this can be all kinds of different thoughts and feelings. Feeling sad and feeling happy, feeling timid and feeling aggressive. All different polarities of different human expression and experience. So what the pendulum teaches us is that our emotions are in a constant state of flux. And that's normal, that's part of being human. The highs and the lows, and in the middle, we have the calm. So the gentle swinging of the pendulum in the center, a calm place that is balanced, but equally, we can swing to the high and swing to the low. Now there's no judgment in the high or the low. It's very exciting to be in the high. It's also very inspirational and engaging to be in the low. As I say, this is part of being human. But it is important that we're not a victim to this experience. So what tends to happen is a lot of us cling to the bottom of the pendulum. And as life's events happen to us, we're thrown into them. So something good happens and we fly up to the high. Something terrible happens and we fly to the low. And then of course we develop preferences. Some of us prefer the high and we do everything to bring ourselves up there. Some of us actually prefer the low and do everything we can to go into the low. The important thing is, is to recognize that life isn't about one or the other state. The optimum way to be healthy and to be in the best possible state for our body and mind to work is to be at the point of balance, which is not down here, but actually up here. So the secret is to climb up the steps of the pendulum and position yourself at the very top where you can observe yourself in the high, observe yourself in the low, but never actually move from the calm place in the middle.